How do viruses outwit bacteria in their struggle for survival? The answer provides new advances in the field of CRISPR-Cas9 gene editing and enables a fail-safe technology to treat or prevent human disease. CRISPR-Cas9 is the gene editing technology that is revolutionizing biological research. Derived from a bacterial defense system discovered in the yogurt industry, it has already been used to engineer crops and livestock, like super goats that produce more meat and have longer hair for making wool. This technology has amazing potential for the personalized treatment of human diseases, like cancer, cystic fibrosis, and muscular dystrophy. It may also be used to battle infectious diseases like HIV and malaria. Just imagine if we could eradicate malaria by releasing engineered mosquitoes into the wild. But before we can use this technology safely in humans, or mosquitoes for that matter, we need to have a reliable off switch. The longer Cas9 remains active in a cell, the greater the chance of mutations that could trigger cancer or have other unintended consequences. To identify an off switch for Cas9, we look to the viruses that kill bacteria, which are known as phages. Since phages are in constant battle with bacteria, they frequently evolve ways to outwit bacterial defense systems. One important bacterial defense system is provided by CRISPR. CRISPR uses phage DNA sequences stored in a sort of genetic library to recognize phages when they attack. Copies of the DNA fragments stored in this library form complexes with the Cas9 nuclease protein. These complexes patrol the cell and destroy invading phages. Bacteria live, phages die. But phages have evolved a way to fight back. In our study, we identified three phage proteins that block Cas9's ability to cut DNA by binding directly to the Cas9 complex. This anti-CRISPR strategy protects the phage from destruction by the bacterial immune system. To see if we could use these anti-CRISPRs in gene editing, we introduced them into cultured human cells. We discovered that each of the anti-CRISPR proteins dramatically inhibited the ability of Cas9 to edit human DNA. We found our off switch. This is an exciting advance for many reasons. These anti-CRISPR proteins provide an important safety feature for human gene therapy applications. They could be used to restrict Cas9 activity to particular tissues, organs, cell types, or developmental stages. They will also provide a useful security measure for engineering insect populations, like our potential malaria-free mosquito. In summary, by studying how phages outwit the CRISPR-Cas bacterial immune system, we were able to identify novel off switches that can be used in gene editing. There are potential applications in medicine, agriculture, biotechnology, and basic research are limitless.